First alert weather team tonight spread out all across the Metroplex and here in the studio with what you need to know. Got Aaron, Madison, Brian, Nick, and also the chief of our first alert weather team, and that is the chief meteorologist, Scott Paget, here to get you updated as we get started at 6 o'clock. And going into tonight, Doug, temperatures continuing to fall. East Fort Worth, right outside our CBS 11 studios, it is 19 degrees. Feeling like four. We've been watching drivers trying to make it up this hill, but this is just iced over. So that's what we're seeing across a lot of North Texas uh, because of the melting that happened today from a lot of cars driving on the sleet and the snow that we saw packing that down. Will we see any more accumulation for tonight? Really not going to be happening for us. We have dry air that's moved its way on in. I've been looking at the radar, seeing a couple little light snow showers trying to hold together, little uh, flurries possible for us. But other than that, not a whole lot happening through the evening hours. So the story that is switching to this dangerous cold that's in place, and we're down to 17 now, indicator to 18 in Fort Worth. The actual temperature is 22 in Midlothian, 23 in Greenville. We have temperatures down to 19 in Comanche, 19 in Mineral Wells. But when you factor the wind, it feels like one right now in Fort Worth. That's the newest information coming in. It feels like zero in Bowie to eight in Dallas to 12 in Terrell. Winds are out of the northwest at 15, gusting up to possibly 25 to near 30 miles. Miles per hour as we go through the evening hours. So, with that in the forecast, I do expect to see our temperatures the next few hours in the low 20s to then start to feel like the single digits. We already have that going on, and that's dangerous cold for that feels like temperature. And, Aaron, we're going to be seeing that dangerous cold stick around into tomorrow. Right, and a wind chill advisory now going into place at 9 o'clock tonight. It's going to continue through 9 o'clock in the morning tomorrow for those dangerous wind chills, feeling like negative 7 to 5 degrees by 7 a.m. tomorrow morning. So hopefully you don't have to go out tomorrow. Uh, if you do, you have to be prepared to not spend a lot of time out in this because extended exposure in this kind of cold, uh, dangerous hypothermia becomes a concern. And then, of course, the slippery roads, which were already concerned with this evening and it's only going to get worse as we kind of continue through the next several hours. So looking at your future feels like temperatures for tomorrow morning. This is what we're anticipating those negative sevens to the west of I-35 Hamilton, Stephenville, Graham, Breckenridge, Bridgeport, zero degrees in Dallas, negative two in Fort Worth and McKinney by 10 o'clock. It's barely changed into tomorrow afternoon. Some sunshine. Those feels like temperatures at least getting into the teens, but high temperatures still expected to be below freezing, Doug.